good afternoon everyone uh, it's my pleasant duty to invite all of you to join us in this uh, valedictory function of the two week ist workshop on photovoltaics the dignitaries are already sitting here i request my colleague uh, ms gaitonde to uh, give them our floral Professor Vasi, <laughs> Professor Kanan Modgalia, <laughs> Professor Fernandez, <laughs> and Professor Solanki. Uh, the format for uh, today's valedictory function is that. Uh, <laughs> I will invite both the faculty members who were involved in the workshop to say a few words about their experiences in the workshop and then uh, we will be uh, visiting uh, the remote centers for your uh, opinion and your reactions to the workshop and then I'll invite the dignitaries to say a few words in closing. Thank you and I'll invite uh, Professor Solanki. See that uh, uh, we have uh uh, we are at the end of the journey that we started uh, about uh, two weeks back. Uh, so this has been a very learning experience for me uh, as well. Uh, the planning of this course, uh, interacting with the people and uh, interacting with the many enthusiastic coordinators. So uh, they have really done a wonderful job and uh, uh, this feeling that I have actually spoken to about 1000 teachers. I have taught them uh, solar photovoltaic to 1000 teachers is a, is a great feeling. Uh, uh, and also uh, the interaction that uh, I had uh, with you during this uh, 10 days of lecture and uh, uh, the nice question answer and also the interaction through email uh, uh, suggests that you know uh, the workshop was quite interesting for you people. Uh, definitely it was very interesting for me and as I said <coughs> I have learned a lot uh, from you uh, <coughs> and your question answers. I hope uh, there is uh, this interaction uh, or this course uh, that you started. Uh, first of all, this course is, is not a normal course, it is not a regular course, uh, but we have undertaken this uh, initiative because uh, this is the need of the hour and as secretary has also mentioned uh, and the minister has mentioned in, in their inaugural talk and secretary also mentioned yesterday that uh, in India we really need uh, a large amount of manpower in solar photovoltaic and uh, who is better a uh, person than a teacher uh, to actually contribute to that. Uh, and that is why it is not a normal course and we have taken it uh, very seriously, a lot of efforts have gone and many uh, as I said I am very happy to see that uh, there is a very good energetic enthusiastic uh, response from the coordinators and the amount of work uh, they and their TA have put into this. Uh, so uh, that is wonderful and uh, uh, thank you very much for that. Uh, I will hand it over to uh, Professor Fernandez. If you want to mention something? Nothing much to say. Uh, yeah, I enjoyed uh, teaching or giving lectures. Mm, a small piece of advice to all the participants is that whatever that we do from here onwards, see to it that it affects uh, the life of a common man. Because when I was teaching, I, I was getting questions which are uh, slightly of too advanced research of nature, and I some of them I did not answer because they were not too relevant. Yeah, you, you can do research. I encourage you to do research, but then solar mission, whatever that was started, I think the primary goal is to electrify the so called electrify the rural areas and to do that we need to have a reliable technology not a too sophisticated technology that is the precise reason I did not answer those questions they were too sophisticated in the solutions were too sophisticated in nature yeah finally my apologies for not putting up my lecture notes on time and whatever the questions that are remaining to be answered, I will do it in a couple of days. And this is not the end, this is just the beginning. If at all, if you have any questions, feel free. 
I am available at dgf at e dot itb dot ac dot in. But before asking me a question, I expect you to do your homework. That somehow it was not very apparent when you people were asking questions. Some of them were, now please forgive me, do not get offended. They were too basic in nature. I think if you sit tight with a paper and a pencil, you should be able to find an answer. Let me tell you, if I give an answer, I will assure you that in no time you will forget. And if you find an answer to your own question, let me assure you, you will never forget. So, keep in mind before asking a question, do your homework. And still, if you have doubts, yes, you can approach me, and if I know, I will answer. My best wishes to all of you. Thank you for listening to me patiently in the last 10 days and again for the last two, three minutes. Thank you. Okay, now, uh, as uh, Dr. Mukta mentioned, uh, we will go through uh, the uh, remote center one by one, and uh, remote center can use this opportunity to uh, talk to us if you want to give any message or <clears throat> just for your own participant uh, participants if you want to or your any administrator from your uh, institute want to give any message so uh, you'll get uh, each of you get about a couple of minutes so make sure that you keep you keep it to about uh, two to three minutes so I'll go one by one to all of you I'm just going by the alphabetical order so uh, no particular preference so first letter uh, I'm going to Amal Jyoti College Kerala sir uh the session was very nice, we have enjoyed well. Sir, uh, in order to continue the interaction, uh, actually is there any vision document or any guidelines for this to continue the interaction between IITB and the participating institutes? Okay, so Moodle, uh, some of you already using Moodle forum is the one uh, medium by which uh, you can continuously interact, not only the coordinators and the, the centers, remote centers, but all other teachers can also continuously interact uh, through the Moodle. So keep visiting Moodle, keep uh, interacting with your other colleagues. It is not only important that you talk to IIT Bombay, but it is also important that you talk to each other, your colleagues uh, from various uh, centers. Okay, uh, thank you uh, for participating. Now I'm going to uh, Amrita Koyamtur. Sir, uh, sh should we get a small feedback from some participants here? Would you like that now? Yes, whatever, if you want to summarize yourself, and I'm requesting to all the coordinators, if the coordinators can use these two, three minutes and summarize their experience, or if there's any senior person, or you can take a feedback from participants. Okay, sir. Sir, we had good sessions here. Uh, we had participants from arts, polytechnic, and engineering. All of them enjoyed doing their experiments. And one or two days when we had cloudy days, we also had some uh, halogen lamp sun simulator to work on with. I would just randomly pass on to one or two people at random to give you a small feedback. Yes, please go ahead. Sir, we are all pleased with the way the workshop was conceived, planned and executed and we have also wondered. We have tried to make maximum, uh, we have gained maximum knowledge and we all turn as actual students by teaching, uh, by, learn, by learning and writing tests and so on. And one, one small request, sir, in the quiz, at least uh, 10 questions should be in the single page or the whole question paper should be on one or two pages. And that experimental session was very interesting and uh, our coordinator was very cooperative and uh, made extra lab visits and all. And the uh, 10 days was very useful and we all remember it well. So this is Sumitra and uh, the sessions which were conducted for all the 10 days were very interesting, very useful. And uh, we were uh, very busy the whole day till uh, till eight o'clock or till ten o'clock in the evening, at night even working out your tutorials and assignments. We were very busy, and we are very much thankful for the professors who uh, conducted the sessions. And uh, and uh, we like to impart what we have gained. Okay, thank you very much for sharing your experience. Uh, even if there is something missing uh, from the other side in the lectures or even the planning, you may 
uh, you may like to share that also. So next, I am going to Amrita School of Engineering, Bangalore. Uh, we enjoyed all the sessions in the uh, workshop for the whole uh, 10 days and especially the quiz se sessions we really enjoyed the most and uh, that uh, uh, quiz sessions really put into us some kind of thinking and uh, uh, more uh, uh, working uh, towards this PV uh, uh, photovoltaics and uh, uh, we would like to impart this uh, uh, knowledge to our students when we go back to our colleges. Thanks for the coordinator. Coordinator was very co cooperative and uh, I hope uh, such programs will be uh, again planned in future also which would help us especially teachers all over India sir. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, next uh, uh, going to Amrita School, Kollam, and after that Besu will come. Uh, Kollam, this is one uh, the, the course has been structured very well. It's actually professional and excellent. The way it is organized, uh, the quizzes are conducted, and uh, it's completed in a very nice and professional manner. I would like to thank uh, you as well as Dr. Fernandez for organizing such an wonderful lecture. And I would also like to thank the entire IIT Bombay team in providing all the infrastructure in conducting laboratory experiments for our participants. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Uh, so right now, College of Engineering, Pune. Professor Pandey, the coordinator. Uh, uh, this, uh, all the sessions here, they are quite uh, exciting and the participants here are so motivated that uh, they will definitely uh, reaching their parent, after reaching their parent uh, organization uh, they have decided to uh, start the some uh, in uh, uh, include the solar photovoltaics in their curriculum also uh, i will uh, uh, I, I would like to pass uh, for some uh, uh, better feedback uh, to one of my pa participants oh, yeah. good afternoon honorable respected dr solanki sir Dr. Fernandi sir and all dignitaries on dais. At the outset, I would like to congratulate and thank you and your team for conducting a very successful workshop on solar photovoltaics under the aegis of MNRE and JNSEM. It is really a very wonderful experience of distance teaching and learning. This workshop brought us a step ahead in solar photovoltaics. Professor Dr. Solanki sir taught this solar PV topic excellently, skillfully and yet lucidly so that it has created a keen interest about PV within us. Your extraordinary contribution in this area truly inspired us. Today no workshop is over but it has ignited our minds so we would like we would like to continue to work and to contribute to make this solar mission successful and for this we will be require your continuous technical support in future too. So with this request once again I thank all of you for such a wonderful academic deliberation and I am also thankful to workshop coordinator of COT Dr. Pandesar and his team for providing excellent facilities during the theory and practice. Thank you, sir. So, I would like to know how the technical support we will get in future from you. Okay, thank you very much uh, for appreciating the effort. Nice to know that you enjoyed the course and will actually be useful. Use it to actually impart the knowledge. Uh, the technical support will be available as I mentioned through the Moodle. So, Moodle uh, is a very, uh, very useful uh, interaction medium for many, many participants. And you can use the Moodle forum uh, to uh, uh, to post your question and uh, get the answers from us or uh, from your other colleagues. Yeah, Besu. <laughs> okay, sir. For for me, actually, let's say uh, the experience was was very pleasant uh, in terms of uh, the interaction which started uh, uh, from the coordinators workshop. Uh, but uh, then again, uh, we had this uh, uh, experiments which uh, we had to perform at IITB itself. And again, the what support we got from IITB in terms of the kits. So I think uh, really we were having talks on how to kind of kind of also improvise on the kits and maybe um, make them kind of uh, we can kind of just upgrade the kits maybe in some aspects. Obviously, with uh, cooperation from your side, 
and uh, some of the participants over here was also interested uh, as you pointed out earlier in uh, getting the kits uh, if obviously they kind of fared well in the <coughs> uh, the quizzes and the assignments uh, <coughs> but apart from that uh, uh, the most important aspect is that uh, some of the participants were really encouraged and they also want to kind of take up some research activities uh, as a part of the center and they were eager to kind of know whether they can pursue their research under NCPRE. So what I had advised them and uh, uh, from whatever knowledge I had gathered from your side that uh, very soon maybe you're going to launch the photovoltaics users program very much like the INUP. So, uh, so maybe uh, people are expecting that uh, INPUP be started soon. So I do not know whether you have a deadline on when the program is about to start. So maybe you can just brief us something about the INPUP program and uh, how similar or how dissimilar it is going to be from the INU, INUP program. Hello, my name is uh, one of the participants, name is Sudip Kuila. That is uh, uh, in, within a 10 days workshop, I am just uh, very much uh, interested regarding the solar cell, uh, how it is made and the different idea regarding the solar cell, PV modules and etc. Et uh, something is gathering. Uh, knowledge for uh, in future uh, that is uh, just I am just very much interested towards about that so automatically I am just uh, uh, research going research uh, on the solar PV module in future uh, so okay. in case of a solar cell module something that is uh, not uh, gathered from this that is a power electronics part. Uh, so actually, I am just dedicated towards the solar cell module, uh, except power electronics part. Okay, thank you uh, uh, for your comments from the Besu. We will uh, will respond to that towards the end of it. Salim, Professor Senthil Kumar was the coordinator. I am Dr. Senthil Kumar, course coordinator speaking. Uh, the, in our remote center, all the participants have actively participated in the uh, lecture session as well as in the uh, practical session. Uh, in the practical sessions, they have conducted the experiments on solar PV cell, uh, that is IV characteristics uh, and uh, 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 solar simulator. Uh, they conducted the experiments and uh, with the effect of temperature they have found, uh, conducted the experiments and uh, they have done the experiments on uh, a PC1D simulator. Uh, they are all uh, excited uh, uh, in the experiments and uh, they actively participated in the uh, quiz. Uh, in the first two quiz, quiz uh, two, three people have not attended and in the third quiz all the people are uh, uh, involved uh, very eagerly in this uh, process. Uh, I would like to ask you uh, two questions. Uh, you said that uh, the Moodle will be useful for a link and uh, which will be used. Uh, uh, my doubt is uh, whether this uh, same username ID will be retained for uh, future use. And another thing is uh, you said that uh, the solar kit will be uh, sent to each uh, participant. Uh, uh, if it is true, uh, when we will have the uh, partisans will get the kit. Over to you. Okay, Professor Senthil Kumar, thank you for your comments. Uh, uh, to your first question, the, the Moodle ID uh, uh, will be, uh, you can use the Moodle ID at least for the next six months and, and depending on the activity we will see. But next six months the same Moodle ID for all participants will be active and you can use it. Regarding the solar kit, we are trying our best to uh, get the approval from MNRE. Uh, so till that happens, uh, uh, we cannot uh, promise anything. Uh, so we are trying to find out the ways in which a solar kit can be provided to the participating colleges. Thank okay. you, sir. Okay. So now we will go to the Jabalpur College. Professor Anurag Trivedi, the coordinator. I would like to share my views regarding this. I am one of the participants here. Uh, before. Uh, sir, I am Preeti Jain. Yeah, please go ahead. Uh, sir, first of all, I would like to extend my heart full of gratitude to all the coordinator and everybody who is directly or indirectly involved in this workshop for providing such uh, 
informative and thought provo provoking knowledge to all of us uh, kindly accept my thanks and gratitude for that and all the lectures were very very well delivered and very informative and we expect some more workshop like this in future if possible uh, thank you sir thank you for everything you have given to us thanks a lot uh, it has been a, a very good experience in our site and uh, all the participants from different college around the jabalpur has participated and they are benefited and in future we are looking for uh, uh, your greater support in respect of more courses and more course material thank you very much thank you very much so jaipur college yeah first of all i would like to thank solanki sir for his very pleasant and very encouraging kind of step that he has taken and it was my first step that i have taken because uh, it was recently i have joined a lecturership and during this time i was been uh, uh, allowed to attend the meeting in uh, mumbai and i have learned a lot of things from chetan sir and my colleagues members also and uh, during this session uh, it is like uh, for me a very encouraging moment and i have learned a lot of things regarding the pv modules and systems also and while uh, interacting with the uh, all the participants even we have the got the chances to learn more things okay thank you very much this kind of system if it is we uh, maintain in continuity uh, that can be beneficial for uh, faculties like us and also those who are eager to know about this this kind of systems and other more innovative Oh yeah, definitely continuity is what is required, and I'm sure uh, the uh, role of each of the coordinators, not only the coordinators, the each of the participant, is very very important. So make sure that you yourself are continuous in your effort, and uh, take along other people with you uh, in this journey. So when you try to take along other people, I'm sure you have to keep your own momentum, and the continuity will be maintained. But we <clears throat> definitely guarantee from our side that all the support will be available to each and everybody. who is willing to uh, put efforts uh, in this direction uh, now i'm going to kajji somaya professor bhandari sir ex uh, needless needless to say that this was a excellent piece of uh, uh, course work that our students participants and we have gone through but certain more details i will like to give uh, our participants range is from young participant of age 23 to uh, age of 50 all of them have really been the students and done a very excellent job uh, what i will like to say is one of our participants is running already running a elective in solar pv at me level but in spite of that she also said that how much the extent of learning that we are going through in this course was really good uh, then uh, uh, participants response i will tell you one or two examples like one day they were part uh, practicing about pc 1d so so they didn't get proper efficiency i it said that uh, this is not uh, that you are not getting proper efficiency so they have gone back and working till 5:30 5:45 and finally getting the results down there then some of the uh, suggestions are like uh, participants being multidisciplinary uh, they want like uh, certain areas of power electronics basics etc to be covered so that uh, they can enjoy it uh, further second is uh, if there is one doubt clearing session after one month or so so that uh, during this time they can send you their doubts and uh, together if you can answer all those uh, doubts in a proper uh, whatever way you feel is appropriate so that one day session of doubt clearing or two day session of doubt clearing will be very much appreciated and one minor complaint is there about the quiz that uh, in the quiz uh, certain question is based on memory based where they are like production of the god proton or photons uh, whatever wavelength so certain questions they said uh, they should have been not been there maybe they missed their top rank by one or two questions so that is the complaint but needless our uh, particular center in top 7 or 8 we have got 6 uh, or 5 uh, or 6 of our persons in the top 7 uh, 8 ranks thank you sir okay thank you very much uh, professor vandari i am sure you have taken very active participation 
uh, and I'm sure all your participant has also done the same thing uh, regarding the complaint. Yes, I, I think if you study a little more harder, all those questions will also become easier uh, for all the participant. Uh, so thank you very much for your contribution. Please uh, give us the detail about. I will send a mail to which are the colleges where elective PV elective is going on, and definitely we will provide uh, more support. This is a good idea about have a doubt clearing session after a month or so. We'll think about it and maybe Moodle is the best way to do that. But uh, still, if there are more uh, requirement of some other medium, we can try to do so. Thank you. Uh, Kakinada, Professor Shubhash Chandra. It's very interesting, sir, this workshop. Uh, sir, the, especially the second phase of uh, coordinators workshop that we have been there was very helpful in running the workshop here, sir, in Kakinada. Uh, the experiments are also uh, very interesting. The, most of the participants are still there. Some of the couple of batches are still there in the lab, sir. They, they preferred uh, to stay there. Uh, and it, it has been a wonderful experience, uh, especially for me and to the participants also. Uh, working on solar photography, really hands-on the uh, last 10 days have been a wonderful time. Sir, I would like to hand over uh, uh, for, uh, to a couple of uh, participants, sir. They want to have some questions uh, to you, sir. Please, please, go ahead. Thank you, Professor Solanki, sir. Actually, I enjoyed your lecture. So good, so nice, sir. Clear explanation is there. I enjoyed it a lot. And Fernand's uh, lecture was also very good. And uh, now, I never expected such a lot of information from both the professors from IIT Bombay. I was thinking that uh, you will be going, we will be going in a highway like that. But you are so clear and so fundamental things you have taught us. We really, we thank you very much, sir. And uh, I feel that so many other centers are there which are deprived of your the lecture. So I feel that all the colleagues in India must be given your video recordings so that the future will be, generation will be benefited much, sir. I feel like that. So, and again, the, the way in which the matter was presented is extremely good, right from the fundamental thing, protection of these things, and the geographically studies all these. So excellent, sir, the vast information you have given in all the days. I was thinking 15 days uh, one single photovoltaic, how to get on like this, I, th I thought, but uh, the time went so quick that I feel that still somewhat to learn like that, sir. Thank you very much, sir. I feel that uh, every college should possess your videos uh, and lectures like that in the e-libraries uh, so that uh, the next generation also will be benefited from your lecture, sir. Uh, okay. Sir, one more part, one. Uh, thank you, sir. A uh, lot of uh, information has been imparted to us uh, for the part participants who are present in the college. We get a lot of information, sir. Uh, we can make the students know about this solar photovoltaic cells because in the future four to five years, lot of power has will be generated from this uh, solar photovoltaic cells. So uh, we can make students to do a lot of mini projects with the information given to us. Thank you, thank you, sir. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Professor Chandra, for your very active uh, coordination. Uh, principal is here, sir. He wants to say just hi to you. Please go ahead. Thank you, Professor Solanki and principal of this uh, Kite College, Dr. Rajaswamy. Uh, I have observed uh, the very interesting part is uh, from such a distance you could uh, speak to our people. And uh, we, this is the best utilization of this uh, e-learning as well as electronic media which we are able to now utilize for the benefit of the students. Definitely we would like to have such more uh, sections in future on different topics and the engineering students are really benefited and uh, uh, not only in the present field as well as they update their knowledge uh, from a far of distance uh, uh, from the inputs given by such experts like you and uh, uh, Professor Fernandez. Uh, I like that uh, our students are really very much uh, um, uh, of the appreciation for the program. I thank you for the uh, total presentation and uh, all the best to you. Thank you. Okay, thank you uh, to, uh, to you and uh, the sharing the wonderful experience. The, the fact that uh, you know, we, uh, two of us cannot actually reach all the teachers in the country and that is why we have been teaching 1000 teachers 
so I request all of you to take uh, this uh, forward and you also become a kind of excellent teacher and, and take this photovoltaic forward. So, thank you very much. Uh, now, <coughs> I am going to uh, uh, KCES College Jalgaon and after that Manipal. Professor Minakshi as the coordinator. Uh, this is Minakshi Choudhury from KC Engineering. Uh, first of all, I am uh, very much thankful to IITB and MNRE for uh, donating us the instruments. Uh. This course is very helpful for all the participants. All the participants have enjoyed this course, uh, theory, theory as well as lectures as well as practicals, especially practicals. Uh, uh, sir, I will hand over the mic to our head of the institute, uh, Professor Powde. He will talk to you. Then some of the participants from, from our remote center. Good afternoon, sir. I am Sanjay Powde. I am vice principal of KCS Engineering College. Our society and college is very thankful to IIT Bombay for organizing such a wonderful session for the multidisciplinary people. Uh, uh, similarly, the kind of uh, hands-on that has been organized along with a good lecture series. Uh, I feel that within the North Maharashtra region, uh, this non-conventional energy sources and solar technology that is going to play a lot of uh, key role in the coming situation. Uh, similarly, uh, if it is possible for IIT to uh, just give us all the inputs uh, so that we can uh, handshake with IIT, MNRE and other institutions to bring this technology to the rural masses nearby as a prototyping mode. So, I hope that IIT gives us more workshops of this kind on uh, other aspects of electrical engineering like wind power or uh, wireless sensor networks or data warehousing, data mining. So, we are very much keen to go for uh, such kinds of workshop in future. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, I now invite some other participants. Good afternoon to everybody. I am Deepak Marathi from Jalgaon. This is my first experience to attend uh, such a type of workshop. In 10 days, Two faculty members give lot of information about photovoltaic. We all are going in our back students' life days. We learn a lot of uh, things which are not able to tell in three minutes. But uh, this uh, workshop is 100 percent successful because there is 10 to 15 minutes for question and uh, answer hours. But uh, every day this question and answer hour requires a very lot of time. Thank you very much. Sir, myself Vipasha Patra. Uh, I just would like to uh, take two minutes from you. Sir, I feel very, uh, means very honorable, very honored to be a part of IIT Bombay, even though it was for a very short span of time. But I feel really very honored and I wish that this opportunity comes to me each and every time. And uh, sir, I just had a request, I means previously also presented it that if we could get some help about power electronics from Fernandez sir, means any book from Fernandez sir, uh, regarding power electronics and sir, the answers of the quiz. The quiz which was uh, given to us, if you could get the answers of those quiz, means we could know that where we went wrong. Thank you, sir. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, uh, definitely, we'll provide you the answers of the quiz uh, that will be uploaded. Uh, the answers are already known. And uh, I think uh, Professor Fernandez is getting so much request for writing a book <coughs> that he has no other option to write it. If he's not writing, you know, keep firing uh, emails to him and I'm sure he will write it. So, now I'm going to Manipal. And after that, Bhopal. Uh, Dr. Rishikesha? It was uh, really a very well planned, uh, structured workshop and very well executed and as well as delivered. Uh, I, I must congratulate you as well as thank you for all the support and uh, co cooperation extended from your side. And uh, I just wanted, uh, uh, there is a request from my side. Can you please uh, uh, put a, a word of advice to all participants? So that uh, how to uh, take this one forward? Okay. After after this workshop, it should not be a full stop. Okay. Uh, the activities should uh, go on. Can you please uh, uh, put a word on this for all participants? Okay. So uh, the, uh, I mean, uh, as I have been telling for the last ten days, and Professor Fernandez must have also been telling that uh, you know <coughs> the one the best way to take it forward is to do lot of homework. And one of the requirement of this course is to actually contribute to the question answer 
uh, you may contribute to the power electronics, you may contribute to the development of the kits. Some participant has al already mentioned that, uh, that they can contribute in the further improvement of the kits. So, by uh, each and uh, participant, if you can contribute in a different way, it will become, uh, it, it will be a step forward and that will help you <coughs> to push yourself forward and the people around you also. Hello, sir. Actually, I am Professor Shanwag from Kendra Engineering College. I am very passionate about the solar energy and I am a life member of Solar Energy Society of India in our college. MNRA approved a Karsha Urja club was functioned from 2006 and this year we had a student chapter of SESI, Solar Energy Society of India, where in which 150 students enrolled and actually we are planning how to go ahead. Certainly your module of this solar energy, whatever you provide, it will be an excellent module or very innovative. It will be helpful us in educating the students where they will be the passing on to the village levels. So, it will be very much helpful and under, under the present scenario of Indian conditions, uh, uh, you should not stop at our education level, you should reach uh, the poorest of the poor. As you know, presently 50 percent of villages under darkness and uh, this is only the thing, solar being a distributed power system, it can uh, immediately implemented on a very larger scale. On this occasion, I would like to remember and uh, one Mr. Dr. Hari Shande of our local man from Manipa, from this region, who, has, uh, who is also a Megase Award winner, implementing this, carrying forward this solar energy to the very remote area village level. Thank you very much, sir. Hello, sir. I am Prof. Professor Nagaraj working here. And I think daily we see, we look at the sun in the sky. But I think whenever I see the sun in the sky, I also see the sun in Mr. Professor Solanki, yourself. You have illuminated, you have so much given to us all these 10 days. And I think uh, all the young people here should learn a lot of things from you. I think how to deliver the lectures and all those things, a lot of things to learn. And I think you have, I have seen the real sun uh, throughout the day here, all the 10 days. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much. So I will change my name from Chetan Solanki to Sun Solanki. Thank you, sir. Okay, Dr. Rishikesha, I, I must uh, uh, particularly thank you because you have been one of the more uh, active uh, coordinator. You have been sending me emails uh, morning, evening. Uh, thank you very much for uh, uh, really coordinating and uh, I am sure uh, all the participants of your college uh, must have enjoyed. Thank you. <coughs> MNIT Bhopal, Dr. Rangnekar. Uh, please accept my hearty congratulations, Dr. Vasi, Professor Kanan, uh, Dr. Solanki, Professor Fernandez, Dr. Farge, Mukta ma'am, Seema ma'am and all the team members for this successful program. As per request, our director has come here for this valedictory function. So, I am handing over this mic to our director, Dr. Appu Kuttan KK sir. I am very happy that uh, in a national wide uh, conferencing, our teaching aid is going to uh, doing on the solar panels all over India and I congratulate IIT Bombay for doing an excellent job because people are not aware about the solar heat so that this is worldwide, it will, national wide it will go so that it can reach to the public very effectively because these, those people who are good trained, they know where it is available, what are the utility, what is the efficiency that can easily implement in villages and urban area. Once again, I will congratulate everybody for this program. Of the participant to give their feedback uh, on this uh, program. Uh, very good afternoon. Uh, first of all, I would like to express my sincere thanks to MNRE and IIT Bombay who have uh, given us such kind of platform as well as student pressure also because we have solved a lot of tutorials, uh, experiment sessions as well. Uh, uh, it was wonderful experience for all of us to hear IIT professors, uh, Chetan sir and uh, Fernandez sir. Uh, as a participant, I can say that this workshop as I am from... Okay, MNIT Bhopal, there is some uh, problem with the... I would like to express my thanks for delivering such good sessions for all these days. We, we enjoyed all these 15 days through the virtual environment that has been provided and I was a little bit apprehensive about the effectiveness of this environment but it has proved to be very effective. We enjoyed all the lectures and also the practical experiences have been provided very effectively and uh, 
we have got a uh, good exposure to the solar voltaic uh, technology. Thank you. Uh, this is Pranok Singh. Uh, the 10 days IST workshop on solar photovoltaics was uh, organized in very excellent manner, sir. And the audio. Uh, sir, I would like to give uh, one one suggestion, if you please listen. Uh, the, I would like to give a suggestion that more focus should be given in future on the application part of the photovoltaic technology. We understood very well your lectures, sir. They were very learning one. We understood the basic technology and how it was uh, formed. And uh, we got full cooperation from our coordinator side, particularly for conducting the... Okay, thank you very much uh, to MNIT Bhopal. Uh, uh, again, there were uh, many participants and they kept answering many questions. Uh, I, I was impressed by MNIT that uh, they have a department of energy and uh, already had an undergraduate program uh, which uh, uh, due to some reason could not continue. But I want to request the principal sir from, uh, uh, from MNIT Bhopal to kind of uh, again uh, restart the course because it is very much required and uh, I think MNIT should be proud of such course that, uh, uh, that it was there in MNIT. Agartala. Yes, sir, Bhatta Acharya. Uh, this was a very wonderful event here. It is indeed a complete uh, successful in our place. And uh, I am uh, thankful to IIT Bombay for giving us the opportunity for organizing this uh, important workshop here. And uh, also I am uh, thankful to my participants who has attended very sincerely this program in spite of very uh, severe cold here. And uh, I am also thankful to my colleagues uh, authority of NIT Agartala for their generous support for successful implementation of the program. And uh, last thing, uh, I will request you on behalf of my institute and my department to come our place so that we can extend our knowledge further in this field. Thank you, sir. Okay, thank you very much for the invitation. Sure, uh, we'll uh, we use this opportunity to come to your college and uh, uh, please continue the. Uh, PV learning and, uh, and, dis and distribution of the knowledge of the photovoltaic. Okay, uh, NIT Calicut, after that NIT Trichy and PhD College Coimbatore. Yeah, hello Arun, uh, go ahead. All the participants here at NIT Calicut, we had a really a nice hello. learning experience. Uh, we had a really a very nice learning experience. I would like to thank IIT Bombay, NCPR, MNRE for giving us a very good uh, lab. Actually, we will be using it for our uh, regular classwork also. Thank you so much for that. I will hand over to one of our participants uh, for the feedback. Anyway, the last 10 days are quite interesting for the all, all the participants in terms of lecture and uh, the practical sessions. Uh, I would like to congratulate both the professors. B.G. Fernandez and uh, Professor Solangi for delivering the nice lectures. And further, the whole participants get inspired from your uh, talk. And uh, especially I want to express uh, that uh, I have prepared a, an article in my Malayalam, in my mother tongue Malayalam to publish uh, in the local uh, newspapers regarding the clean energy options. Okay, thank you, sir. NIT Trichy. It was uh, really great and wonderful. I have been telling, I have been telling uh, my colleagues, friends and even family members for the past 10 days that I have been so uh, fortunate to participate in this workshop. That was uh, because of so many good reasons. It is a great job on the part of the government of our nation and on the part of the solar energy expert Professor Solanki. The venture in the name of workshop is highly relevant and essential in the present global scenario. We wish many more such meaningful and useful activities to come up for uh, everyone's benefit in the days to come. It is not an exaggeration if I say that that was a 10 days a feast to all of us. Our quest and thirst of knowledge were very well treated in the field of energy. Continuation of learning and furthering the amalgamation among ourselves through the services of Moodle portal by the extension of usage time up to a period of one year is also very good. We wish this kind of uh, services to be available for other academic and social domains too very soon. What we have learned is not only energy, solar energy, but also learned how a workshop should be 
how a presentation should be, and how laboratory manuals and classes should be, and many more. The overwhelming, the overwhelming enthusiasm and support by MHRD and its allies have truly improved our academic and research capabilities and have stirred up in us our curiosity, boldness, perseverance, excitement and passion and the need for humility and ethics. For this we express our sincere thanks and gratitude to them. The prompt, gentle and polite treatment by our remote centre NIT Trichy its coordinator, Professor Saravana Ilango, and his team members deserve <laughs> special thanks for their dynamic and dedicated services. We must say that Professor Solange and Professor Fernandez have become immortal in our humble memories. It is great and exciting to think that we all have been engaged <laughs> Okay, okay, let me stop. Thank you, thank you. Uh, on behalf of all the participants, I thank you for organizing this wonderful workshop, which motivated us extensively. You really made us to experience the IIT student life from here itself by giving assignments, tutorials, and quiz, etc. <laughs> one suggestion from our side is one session may be arranged uh, with MNRE on MNRE phone remote center coordinator, Dr. Ilango, for organizing this wonderful workshop in our institute. Thank you once again. Just a last word, sir. Uh, Today has happened to be the Dakshinayana, the uh, second solstice day of the year. So it's a, it's a nice co coincidence that we are ending up this session today. Thank you. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. So which means that you attended my first lecture uh, seriously. So today, yeah, it is the, the southest, uh, uh, south most position of the sun. And the sun will start trekking back. So thank you very much, uh, Professor Sarvana. I, I think uh, at your center also it has very active participation uh, from your side and all the participants. Uh, and thank you very much. Okay, Varangal. Sorry. Program is most valuable and very much useful, sir. And it has given more I think, practical experience, particularly the experimentation. Our participants really enjoyed, sir. And the participants are, I think, very much motivated and they are requesting the experimental equipment okay, if you supply it to their institutes i think they are very they are very much anxious in that in that point sir particularly the manufacturing de i think about the lecture classes manufacturing details of uh, silicon cells i think that detail we are, we are i think we are we are enjoying sir we have enjoyed that lecture particularly and also the regarding the the electrical uh, topic Professor Fernandez, sir, I think he has given uh, very valuable information. Thank you, sir. I think my, I am requesting my uh, our director will speak, sir. Uh, I am Professor Srinivasa, director of NIT Varangal, and uh, in fact, yeah, this uh, uh, program has uh, given a, a very good inputs to uh, all our participants. I am told that they enjoyed the uh, both practical sessions and uh, lectures. And um, uh, they they have given the feedback that um, many such programs are organized through this uh, software. They uh, they would like to participate in future activities. So everybody has enjoyed, and it's a wonderful show. And my congratulations to uh, all of you and uh, to uh, our group from NIT Varangal. Thank you. Participant wants to say a few words regarding this program, <laughs> <coughs> sir. Uh, Thank you very much, sir, for organizing such a wonderful uh, program. And uh, most of my doubts were cleared. Uh, but, uh, sir, my one suggestion, sir, that at least one day should be dedicated for uh, the research that are, going, that are going on in this area. Because any education without knowing what is happening to the latest research is incomplete. So I think that today, at least the last day, should be uh, spent completely towards the latest research that is going on in this area. And uh, of course, uh, Fernandez sir was uh, actually in between. He was trying to explain what are the re all our research doubt, and we are really, really thankful to him. But uh, actual research that is going on that we want to know, sir. And uh, uh, first day in the inaugural also, we were very much happy that uh, we could hear to, uh, to the ministry, um, uh, Faruk Abdullah, and to the MHRD uh, secretary and yesterday MNRE secretary also. Similarly, in the last day, at least uh, using our uh, AVU softwares, uh, experts from different IITs, if they can spend half an hour and what is the research that they are doing in this area, 
uh, without any doubt section so that half an hour they can tell what they know or what they are doing in the later scene. That will be really helpful and uh, uh, education would have been complete, sir. That is what I feel uh, and uh, this okay. is my suggestion. Yeah, thank you very much. I think it is a wonderful suggestion to, uh, to plan some time where you can uh, talk about the research that is going in the area which, uh, which is being taught. So, definitely we will take care of that. I would like to thank director for uh, taking time to come out for this function and thank you very much to the coordinator also. Thank you. NIT Kurukshetra after that, we will again go to Niranjali. Nirjali. Conversation Professor Savanti and other organizations. It was a very nice course. Actually, in the beginning, some of the participants were afraid of the cold. I think, so reaching to you? So, reaching to you? Okay. But uh, later on, everybody seems to be interested in the course, especially in the uh, practical portion of it. But some of them will like to say something in this regard. So I'll hand over the mic to the participants. This call, again, I want to congratulate the IIT Bombay uh, for instituting this uh, uh, workshop, like uh, where, where, from where we can even participate from the other uh, remote areas can uh, attend this type of lectures, useful lectures. And I especially like thank Professor Salanti for the good lectures and making our lives easier. I think this is good teaching. Uh, Professor Salanti, hello. I, I oh, thank the, to you for making our life easier by teaching this type of subject. I am a teacher in physics at NIT Kurukshetra and uh, I may assure you that uh, uh, I will uh, teach these uh, experiments and uh, experiment by taking the kit from our coordinator here, Madam Rathna Zainya. And also, if you provide us separately, then it's fine, otherwise I will take from them. And also, uh, I assure you that some part of the research which is taught by you, this book is very helpful and will certainly include these uh, CD modules uh, for the uh, MTEC in instrumentation where the students can do it and do the This will be very helpful. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, yeah, thank you very much uh, uh, to Dr. Dahiya and uh, all the participant. Uh, uh, Professor Dahiya also mentioned me that you know initially it, uh, it was response was slow, but later all the participant really got excited. Uh, so thank you very much for taking active part. And uh, as one of the participant uh, assured me, so I fully take your assurance uh, that it will uh, you'll be taking it forward. Thank you. Okay, Gandhi Nagar. Yeah, this is Vijesh uh, and Professor Indrajit Mukherjee from IIT uh, PDPU Gandhinagar. Professor Solanki, uh, our hearty congratulations to you and the whole team member. You know, this was a wonderful experience for these young teachers from Polytechnics and all over engineering college in Gujarat. They could learn lot of things and clear, clarify their ideas on photovoltaics and their applications. And in addition to that, from our university point of view, we have taken initiative to show them one megawatt live power plant so that they can, uh, you know, uh, get more experience about uh, what the reality is. So, uh, our congratulations really to you for such wonderful workshop. Namaste, this is Nita Joshi. Sir, I would like to thank you for this uh, workshop and I am really impressed by the name Eklavya who did his study without his teacher. The teacher was virtual and here you are. So you are drawn up for us. So we all are getting knowledge from you. If we are in real presence of you, I don't, uh, I think uh, it will be our great pleasure. So in near future I would like to meet you and we all are trying to come to IIT Bombay. I am also thankful to Dr. Pathak uh, who told us that how we should design a question paper. I am also thankful to Dr. Fernandes, but uh, we could not solve his assignment. We are very sorry for that. I am uh, thankful to our coordinators, Vijayesh Tripathi sir, Dr. Mukhopadhyay and his PDPU team. So we will see you sir. Uh, there is, uh, this is the tradition of our Rig Veda. 
uh, it is said that always focus your attention at the center of the solar system where the sun the supreme power of universe resides and you are going in the same direction all the congratulations to you sir thank you very much okay thank you very much uh, uh, i think uh, dr prajesh has done a wonderful job in coordinating uh, uh, this whole workshop he has also been very active so uh, congratulations to you and uh, to the participants also and uh, uh, good to see that you enjoyed and uh, wonderful that you actually t uh, taken them to 1 megawatt uh, power plant. Uh, it would be nice if you can organize this uh, visit for the other remote centers also. So, they will also learn a lot from that uh, practical seeing the power plant. So, thank you very much for that. PhD College Coimbatore, Professor Chandran. It was very interesting. You have supplied the kids in time. It was very wonderful. And also, we enjoyed the lectures, your lecture and uh, Dr. Fernandez's lecture. We are already running a course from 99 onwards, an ME energy engineering course. We are also having a 10 kilowatt uh, solar plant. So, all of the participants, uh, they participated in a very well. Some of them, they visited the plant also, our plant also. I will pass on this to one of the participants. She will explain you her experience. So, good evening. All our participants had a very good time and uh, we actually had the intricacies or uh, in other words I could say that we are empowered with the intricacies of the solar PV system design. And this is much wanted today because the skilled engineers as you said that solar PV has got a bright career and bright future. We need a skillful engineers and researchers and I think uh, this is a time for us to express our gratitude to all of you people and structures and transforming us into a very skillful researchers and engineers. And another thing which I would like to tell us, as Professor Patak said, Teaching Thousand Teachers program has all, has a wonderful step in this particular program and uh, this will definitely transform the education system in a very good way. So one, two things which I would like to say in this particular time is uh, what kind of support we can get from the NCPRE for the researchers in the solar PV system and for the participants those who have attended this program. This is one question which I would like to put forth to the committee. And the other question is our students are already motivated with the solar PV course and having that as an elective course to be offered is also clearly uh, the, def uh, the requirement has been understood by the students and also as a faculty. But still in placement point of view because nowadays the students always think in the placement point of view and what kind of motivation we can provide to the students such that they will be encouraged to take up this as a course in their career apart from the PG. I am talking about for the UG students and so these are the two questions which I would like to ask to the organizers and uh, on behalf of the PSG remote center participants we would like to express our sincere gratitude for empowering us with the knowledge on PV systems and also to the local coordinator Dr. Chandran who had helped us in all the experimental activities and the laboratory schedules. In fact, he has also explained us uh, regarding the harmonics and we analyze the inverter functions in a very good way. Thanks for the organizers for having given us the opportunity. Thank you. Okay, uh, thank you very much uh, Professor Chandran and uh, the participant. Uh, uh, regarding your questions, uh, what kind of support and what uh, research facilities of Professor Vashi is here. Uh, somebody is also asking regarding the photovoltaic users program. So, I think uh, in the, uh, we can discuss it towards the end of it, what kind of support we can provide. And uh, as the photovoltaic program in the country and in the world is uh, developing to a larger scale, I am sure students other than teaching will find lot of opportunities in the industry uh, as an engineer, as a researcher as a technician and there are so many possibilities uh, I think that will unfold uh, uh, all in near future. So, now I am going to the PVG Pune, Professor Gauri Karve. Okay, thank, thanks a lot for tremendous efforts by you and your team and Fernandes sir. My participants are enjoying your lectures, cute, quiz, everything, your books also and lectures and practicals also. I am Dr. Mrs. Jeff, uh, head of the electrical engineering department. On behalf of uh, PVG COET, 
I am profusely thankful to IIT Bombay and MNRE for conducting such a nice exhaustive and extensive workshop. All the participants are very much impressed by this workshop and uh, they learnt a lot from the theory and the practical sessions. One thing I would like to mention is that the practical set are very elaborate and simple and uh, uh, basic research in the PV can be taken up uh, with this uh, basic information. Uh, I'm once again I'm thankful to you, Fernandez sir and uh, Mukta Atre madam. I have attended such type of distance learning program for the first time and it is very uh, nice experience. All of us, uh, uh, all of us uh, enjoyed all the theory as well as practical sessions. Uh, I would like to uh, mention here that the practical sets are very nice and we would like to include some of the experiments in our und undergraduate course like material science and renewable energy in our uh, college. Uh, uh, thank you sir. Myself. Dr. Vilas Parande from Barbit, uh, College of Engineering, Pune. The course content design was excellent, sir, and it is well balanced for interdisciplinary faculties. Uh, then the, the time management which you have provided is very good and well planned with lectures, practicals, follow tutorials and assignments also. The online quiz competition really healthy in the our entire participants and we cons uh, take it very seriously and appear just like a examination so we have really enjoyed the life of students <laughs> here yeah. Yeah. and the mod uh, module facility which is provided is very good infrastructure including audio video internet facility library which are present in pvg hospitality also is very good so thanks to coordinator principal entire team yeah. but not least we say that we congratulate on behalf of all the participants to iit bombay by giving a big clamp standing clamp to you thank you very much it is so kind of you to appreciate the effort uh, but the better appreciation uh, is of course you uh, know take it forward and uh, train another uh, 40 student uh, each year in photovoltaic. I would like to thank uh, Professor Gauri, he, she has also been very active uh, in participating and uh, uh, in all the event and I think uh, the workshop is very nicely conducted uh, uh, at uh, PVG college. So, uh, thank your coordinator for that also. Thank you. Mm -hmm.